How are you holding up after the elimination? I'm great. It's it's one of those things where obviously I'm just going to miss being here for this process. It's, you know, it's one thing to keep moving on. The press is awesome. <laughs> and um, to get the exposure, I've already gotten so much. Um, the people that I think I started with like 900 Twitter followers, and last time I checked, I was about like 25,000. So that's insane, you know? Yeah. Um, that kind of a jump uh, is ridiculous. It's it's unparalleled the kind of support that I've been getting. I could have never imagined um, to get this much in my life. And like I've heard people say, you know, even though I'm going home now, a it's the top 12. It's huge, yeah. especially coming back from last season. Right. And it's millions of people that didn't know your name who now do. Um, so I think the fact that people know who I am now is just great. Did you have any like, gut feelings earlier today or last night that maybe this was going to be your last round? Oh, yeah. Ever since the song choice, I thought this could be my last round. But I, I, I came to terms with that. I had, um, I had thought about it. I lost sleep over it. It was this, you know, we were trying to figure out whether or not it was the right move to make. But in the end, I went with it just because that's what, that's also what my gut said. It said, this is the right move to make. Sometimes you don't. I mean, there's a, there's a lot of stress involved with this. I've been away from my family for a long time. Um, but not only that, but there's just so much more for me out there that I think the show's given me an amazing platform to move on. But I think I have a lot more to give in terms of just writing and performing, going on tours and stuff like that. I mean, you and Shakira were kind of going through this process together because this was her first year. and right. I mean, it's your second year, kind of-ish, because you, right. yeah, you have right. come back. But so, like, what do you feel like was, like, the best or most memorable moment for the two of you guys together in this process as you were trying to figure everything out? Um, I always think about how, obviously, she just had her son. Yeah. Um, or not just, but, you know, in the past. Right. Uh, recently, she had uh, a baby, and... I, I saw her coming into a rehearsal one day holding him and it just reminded me of the pictures that I've seen of me and my dad when I was sitting in his lap playing the drums and then I, I walk in and here she is playing piano with him on the lap and I just started, it was just so cool to see how cool she is not only as a coach and artist but as a mother, it's such a cool thing to see, she's such a real person and it's you know, I love her to death. Yeah. Well, at going forward, are you thinking maybe some kind of collaboration with her, or are you kind of just advice, guidance? I actually do have one song in particular that I've written that I think she would enjoy. I cross my fingers. Hopefully this doesn't backfire on me. <laughs> um, but I, I wrote it before we even started working together, but I, I continued to develop it ever since we I made it on the team. And um, I think... Even if I just got an occasional high from her, that would be an honor. Like, seriously, she's so cool, such an amazing person. So any form of contact, whether that be collaboration or um, material or something, anything, really, that I can get out of it, even if it's just her words of wisdom. Yeah. Before I let you go, what are your plans for next in your future? Is anything significant or concrete at this point I have nothing's completely concrete but except I can guarantee that I'm going to be spending a lot of time with the people that have been supporting me and doing some hometown shows but I have uh, some plans in my head to do uh, some sort of album with the original material that I have over 30 songs right now written um, ready to record and I have um, some ideas that I might want to do a tour or something like that um, play out as much as possible that's the other thing I've gotten from this is performing live